As technology continues to evolve, so does the threat of AI-generated false videos on YouTube. These videos can be created with such precision and accuracy that it's often difficult for even the most experienced viewer to distinguish them from real footage. This can lead to severe consequences for both public figures and everyday consumers. One issue that arises from AI-generated false videos is the impact on public figures. With the rise of deepfake technology, it's possible to create videos that make it look like a famous person is saying or doing something they never actually did. This can harm their reputation and even put their safety at risk. For instance, a deepfake video could be created to show a public figure making offensive remarks, which could result in a loss of public support and even threats of violence. But it's not just public figures who are at risk. Everyday users can also fall victim to false videos on YouTube. For example, a video could be created that promotes a fake product, making users believe it's legitimate and trustworthy. This can lead to users wasting their money on something that doesn't even exist, or worse, putting their health at risk by using a dangerous product. In addition to false videos, AI-generated content can also take the form of fake ads and comments. These can be just as dangerous as false videos, as they can deceive users into making poor decisions or disclosing personal information. While YouTube has taken some steps to combat this issue, such as banning deepfake videos, it's clear that more needs to be done to protect the public from the dangers of false content. Users must remain vigilant and report any false content they come across to help create a safer online environment. In conclusion, the threat of AI-generated false videos on YouTube is very real and can have severe consequences for both public figures and everyday users. By staying informed and working together, we can combat this issue and ensure that the content on YouTube is truthful and safe for everyone.